Hello! Kumusta po kayo? Mayroon po kong ikukwento sa inyo. Kwento ng papel. That was shared with me by a missionary when I was still a seminarian in the Divine Word Seminary. Okay, ano po ang kwento ng papel? Lahat tayo pinanganak, lahat tayo mamamatay. Klaro. Simple lang po. Nung pinanganak po tayo, malinis. It's up to you. Gawin mong madumi yan, madumi yan. Gawin mong malinis yan, malinis yan. It's your call, it's your choice. We believe in one God. Isang Diyos. Siya ang ating pag-asa. Mga kapatid, ang Diyos natin ay Santisima Trinidad. Ang una po ay ang ating Diyos Ama, lumikha ng langit at lupa. The Lord who created you and me. Second person, God the Son, Jesus who suffered and died for you and for me. Third person is the Holy Spirit. Siya po ang ating kasama at ang ating guide. Punta ka dito, punta ka doon, the guide. Okay. Now, what are the three things that dapat natin gawin habang buhay pa tayo? Number one, love God. Mahalin mo ang Diyos. Huwag mo siyang kakalimutan. Mahal na mahal ka niya. Pagsilbihan mo siya. Number two, love your neighbor. And simply means, don't hurt. Huwag mong sasaktan, lalamangan ang iyong kapwa. At magbahagi ka. You share your blessings, your talents, your time. And don't forget, love yourself. Mahalin mo ang iyong sarili. Pagkat mahal na mahal ka ng Panginoon. Ano pong hindi natin kailangan habang naglalakbay tayo sa mundong ito? Tanggalin na po ang kasalanan. Malayan. Mga sasamang ugali just makes you unhappy. Ano po po? Tanggalin po natin ang mga pabigat sa puso. Naku, yung mga galit, sama ng loob, kayabangan. Goodbye. You don't need those. Pag nagawa mo po yan, ito, siya ang para sa iyo. Nandyan siya. Ayan, ang ating Panginoong si Yeso Kristo. Ano pong kwento ng Panginoong Yeso Kristo? Pinako siya sa krus because he told the truth. He was crucified between two thieves. Pinatay siya parang isang kriminal. Pinagtawanan. Kasama yan sa buhay natin na mayroong mga pagkakataon We are persecuted. You can be crucified between two things or pwede tayong sirain but it's part of our being Christians. Nilagay po nila yung sign, the Inri sign. Jesus of Nazareth, King of the Jews. Tapos, ito, pierced with a lance. Jesus was pierced with the lines. And, ito po, they played dice. Pinagsugalan ang kaisa-isa niyang ari-arian. His only property in this world that was his clothes. That's the story of our Lord and God. What should we do while we are still alive? Who is Jesus for us? Jesus is the way the truth, and the life. And what should we do habang buhay pa ho tayo? You love. Love God. Love your neighbor. Love yourself. Yeah. Who is Jesus for us, mga kapatid? Ito po. Jesus, He. He is my God. He is my friend. He is my everything. He is the one who loves me and you all the way. 
Iyan ang Panginoon sa buhay po natin. Yes? And God, Jesus is so important. Tignan niyo po. Pag tinanggal mo si Jesus, kung wala si Jesus sa buhay mo, life is hell. Opo, impero na po. <laughs> so mga kapatid, If you're going through any difficulty right now, just welcome Jesus. Panginoon, kailangan kita sa buhay ko. We need you. Kailangan ka namin, Panginoon. At paano po matanggal ng hell sa buhay ng isang tao? There's only one remedy po. The only remedy is this. You have to go back to this. The most important thing. Keep going back, mga kapatid. And you will have a beautiful, meaningful life if you know how to love, to love again. So, you can love again if Jesus is at the center of your life. Yan po ang kwento ng papel. kwento ng buhay natin lahat. God bless you and Mama Mary loves you. Sana po maging mas personal ang Panginoon sa puso ng bawat isa sa atin. Amen. <music>